Besides your family, your ability to earn an income may be your most important asset. Disability income insurance helps protect your income if a disability or illness prevents you from working. Most people don't realize the risk of becoming disabled in today's workplace. Consider pregnancy, back injuries, bronchitis, pneumonia, surgery, or an accident. And many of us simply don't have enough savings to cover the loss of income, even for a few weeks. A disability insurance policy can help provide you with the income protection you need so you can focus on recovery. Think of disability insurance as insurance for your paycheck. It pays you cash benefits when you are sick or hurt and can't work, giving you peace of mind, knowing that you will be able to continue paying for things like your groceries, mortgage, or utilities. So let's talk about short-term disability benefits. Through your employer's benefit program, your short-term disability plan will replace a percentage of your before-tax income while you were unable to work. These benefits are payable directly to you, as long as you are disabled for a specified period of time. Benefits are payable after your elimination period, which is the amount of days you need to be disabled before benefits begin to accrue. There is a waiting period for benefits depending if your disability was as a result of an accident or illness. This plan also has a pre-existing condition limitation if you are newly enrolling. A pre-existing condition is one for which you have received medical treatment, consultation, care or services including diagnostic measures, or if you were prescribed or took prescription medications in the predetermined time frame prior to your effective date of coverage. By selecting short-term disability from your workplace benefits plan, you will receive benefits if you suffer from a covered disability so you can focus on what's important, getting healthy and back to work. Please refer to your benefit summary for exclusions and limitations for this plan or contact your benefits administrator if you have any questions.